Right now, um, I'm trying to renew some larger accounts that I closed last year and lining them up for services for the next school year. And they're, you know, sizable accounts. But what's happened is it's been a little bit of a bumpy start. It was the first, first time using uh, virtual services. I, we do virtual services for schools, for speech and OT and mental health services. And so now I'm like, oh, how do you... How do I have this call when I know it's been so super rocky? We've all we've been very highly communicative. We've resolved a lot of the issues. Mm -hmm. We've worked really close. We've had our whole team involved to make sure the kiddos got what they needed. Like we've really been proactive to keep them happy. But you know they're still kind of they didn't forget. <laughs> For sure. The year went so. Yeah, I'm just stuck on the conversation to renew them for the next year. Do they? Where are we at in terms of this renewal? Do they have to renew right now? Is this your ideal time to get them to renew? Is there some runway where they can wait to renew? Or is this, I've got to do it right now or I'm going to learn lose the service for next year? Um, they start kind of planning. They're always looking for in-person first. And so I'm trying to get ahead of the eight ball. Uh, generally, it's not until the spring. Um, I'd say March. Um, okay. or April, but I, you know, in, in some of these states, it takes a while to recruit the, enough clinicians to support their needs. It can take upwards of three to four months. And so I want them to be able to start mid August. I just want this off their plate for them. Like, mm -hmm. let's not go through this again. Okay. Know? Here's what I want you to do. Okay. Light some sage. Okay. I want you to get all of the negativity of the program has been off to a bumpy start out of your head, okay? We're for sure not going to call and apologize and then ask them for a renewal. That sounds like this. Hey, Carmen, Matt, Easton with Easton University. I know things were real bumpy with the lives and the portal was down, but uh, just calling to see, you know, we can keep things going, keep the momentum going, get your renewal. Okay, we're not going to do that. Here's what we're going to do. We're going to call and say something like this. Hey, Carmen, Matt, Easton uh, with Easton Education Services. Uh, can't believe it's been nine months already. This is the time when our uh, school districts typically renew their contracts so that they can have access to the top tier uh, educators. Call to see if it makes sense to get that renewal signed this week. I'm on my mobile, 720-660-3202. You're going to be scared that they're going to smash you because they had some difficulties. Only about 20% of that is going to be true. About 80% of that's always in your head. Okay. So a lot of them are going to be like, oh yeah, absolutely. How do we get it signed? Right. Don't bring up the negative. Now for the 20% that do, you're just going to agree and go through your objection handling. You're right. Your eight steps. Totally get it. Right. Does it make sense to me? Man, we're just really upset. Man, it was really bumpy last year. Totally understand. Right. Does it make sense to get the renewal? Uh, yeah, congratulations, you made a great decision. What happens next, I'm gonna, boom, right? So easy. I'm not getting in an argument with them. I'm not explaining my position. They were there. They saw the movie, okay? They were on the bumpy flight. Doesn't mean they don't want to fly home, right? I totally understand. Does it make sense to sign the real? No, we're not renewing. It was terrible last school year. What are some of your thoughts? Well, I, I, I don't know. I mean, we got to have these services for our kiddos. D totally agree, which is why I recommend doing the renewal right now so we can make sure you get access to top tier talent, right? Well, is there any way you can ensure that I don't have XYZ problem like I had last year? Absolutely, we've taken care of that in blah, 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 blah. Or if you can't, don't lie. Hey, we're gonna do everything in our power to make sure we get through it. I will be here with you every step of the way, but what's most important is that we have these services for the kiddos, right? Uh, I just, I'm really upset about this, right? And I'm not gonna go through all the steps of objections, but go through that course, right? Step six, I just wanna make sure that I'm clear on something here, Carmen, is the fact that we had a little bit bumpiness on the onboarding last year, is that stopping you from getting these services out to the kids for the 2025 school year? Well, no. They just don't like how it went down last year. I totally agree, right? Which is why we've put this, this, and this in place. Does it make sense to renew your contract, right? If they still say no, right? What's a good next step for me? Can you go and put together a document, 
kind of outlining how you guys are improving this. If they're like, I don't know, we just don't want to use you, right? Hey, I will be here when you need to get these services for these kiddos. I understand there was some bumps in the road last year. We are the best in the world at dealing with this. We've dealt with that. And if we don't get this set up right now, we're just going to keep kicking that can down by the river and you're going to have issues coming next school year where they've got nothing. And at that point, we're really limited to what we can do. Fair enough? Right? And then you can just simply call them back. But what I want you to do is stay positive and deal with these issues as they come. But I don't ever want you to like apologize in terms of, oh my gosh, I'm really sorry. It is what it is. You guys did your best, right? You got through it. And at the end of the day, they got the services. And at the end of the day, having a bumpy flight is still better than walking to your location. Okay? So just keep that in mind and go through. Go use your renewal the same way you would have closed. Can't believe it's been eight months. We're right at the point where if we sign the renewal right now, we can get first pick on top talent. Does it make sense to get that renewal set up by tomorrow afternoon? Yeah. Congratulations. You made a great decision. I'll shoot you over a DocuSign. Right? Let's keep it simple.